morning. So first and foremost, I just woke up not too long ago, so I look like a hot mess. Um, literally woke up like this. <laughs> so I am actually at Hubs' house again, and I made him breakfast because he did come home early from work again, and I decided, you know what, like since I feel like I'm gonna do some stuff today, let me just go ahead and vlog it. So I did make breakfast. I left my camera in my car, so I wasn't able to film me cooking breakfast, but I just made chocolate chip pancakes and scrambled eggs for him, scrambled egg whites for myself, and I just toasted some croissants. So that was what we ate for breakfast. So Hubs actually ran to the gym really quick, and I am just doing his laundry, folding his laundry, switching it out and stuff. And then I think later on we have to run some errands. So I do want to go to Michael's and I want to go to Marshall's, Target. I just want to go around because I do need to start thinking of how I'm going to be making my bridesmaid proposal boxes. Um, my engagement party, or I should say our engagement party, is on Saturday, July 27. So I do have um, a little bit over a week to start getting everything together. So I kind of just want to go to the stores today just to see if I can get some ideas. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get anything right now. If there's nothing that I like, I'm not going to force it, you know. So that's what the plan is today. Day. it's supposed to rain at some point the heat here has just been insane like we've just been hit with this massive heat and humidity it's crazy like it's like upper 90s but it feels like it's in the 100s just because of the humidity so it's absolutely disgusting outside so today we're planning or we're supposed to get rain so hopefully we can go out before it starts raining but we'll see <music> Yes. Yeah, so 
so that's where the plan is today. So I figured that I would take you guys along with us. Just do some window shopping and then just a little bit buying. home I tried to film at the mall but it was so packed like extremely packed I mean it makes sense because no one wants to be outdoors today because it was so hot um, but I just want to show you what I got from Yankee Candle really quick I did get a bunch of stuff from Bath and Body Works of course but I'm going to be saving that for um, like a haul video coming up so I want to show you guys just two things that I got these were still 75% off so these ended up being only like seven dollars and 35 cents if I'm not mistaken let me check my receipt do, 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 do. yes seven dollars and 37 cents each so I got this one which is in turquoise glass I saw this online during their semi-annual sale and I wanted to get it but I kind of just skipped out on it but it smells amazing like perfect refreshing and aquatic scent like perfect for the bathroom which is where I'm gonna be burning this so love that one and then the other one that I got is another um, large jar candle they had a bunch of different candles that were still 75% off so I highly recommend you guys check out your local Yankee candle if you're interested but I got this one which is in apple spice so I definitely had to get a fall candle in here because I'm already starting to purchase my fall candles I'm over summer a thousand percent so I am starting my fall burning early this year so yeah I just wanted to show you my two quick Yankee candle purchases okay guys so I apologize I feel like this vlog is very choppy and not cohesive whatsoever but it's just been a crazy couple of weeks with just preparing for the engagement party it's a joint thing so it's basically a combination of our engagement party and then a surprise birthday party for my grandfather because he's turning 95 um, so it's just a lot of preparation and we're having a lot of family come over and my dad's sister is actually already here with us so it's just been crazy busy so I apologize for that but I also wanted to take this time to just sit down with you guys and just talk because I feel like I haven't really sat down and had a conversation with you guys. I feel like the last time I did that was when I made my dealing with deployment during the holidays video. So I kind of just wanted that to be like the main focus of this vlog. Hopefully not making this vlog like too too long. So I have the AC running in the background so I'm going to try to talk loud so I can talk over it but if you hear that buzzing noise it's my AC. It's just been so hot here. We've been hit with that massive heat wave where it's basically been in like the one hundreds and it's just crazy so yeah I can't sit here and not have that on because I will melt away but anyway so I wanted to talk about I guess like the direction of my channel and why I've been inconsistent with my channel and with my videos sometimes like you experience some burnouts or basically just time periods where you're just very 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 unmotivated to do anything and I think that's where I'm finding myself to be a lot more recently a little update and a little background um, I did finally finish my undergrad so I did finish my bachelor's degree and my degree was in health science but with a pre-med track so I still plan on going to medical school eventually and I say eventually because I'm taking a non-traditional route traditionally speaking I would have applied to medical school already and already be accepted at this point and starting this coming like fall semester but I'm taking the non-traditional route because my undergrad experience getting to where I am today it was it was like the toughest journey I've experienced so far and I'm going to delve into it in a separate video because I do genuinely want to talk to you guys about that part of my life but not getting into it 
in this video but essentially like right now just so you guys know I am done I'm completely done I finished all the summer courses and everything so now my next step is doing a post back program and essentially a post back program is a way for me to get all of those pre-med courses I didn't finish all of my pre-med requirements for medical school like I didn't do the orgo one orgo two biochem like I didn't do those courses and I want to redo like physics one and physics two so essentially by taking Taking the post back program I'll be able to get all of those underneath my belt so the post back program I initially wanted to take a break for like an entire two years because I wanted to take this year off to plan the wedding because our wedding is going to be next year in October of 2020 so just with the timing of everything I didn't want to be too stressed out with doing the post back program like at the same time of preparing for the wedding but now I'm thinking of just doing it anyway. I'm thinking of it in the sense where I don't want to waste more time than I already did. Not that it's a race and I keep trying to remind myself that, that you know getting your degree or getting to the finish line of what you want to do in life is not a race and it really isn't. It's just a matter of like for me personally it's a matter of getting it done at some point and achieving it at some point you know like that's the end goal is to just achieve it. No matter how you get there, no matter how long it's going to take, no matter the detours and everything that you're going to inevitably take also, that's the end goal. I just keep reminding myself that although medical school and the path to becoming a physician is time consuming as it is, you know, you're basically sacrificing like 10 plus years depending on the specialty you want to get into. So I just keep telling myself that, you know, it's not a race to get to where I want to get to. It's just a matter of... I will finish and I will get there in time so bringing it back and basically relating it to when it comes to my YouTube basically as of right now I am NOT working like this is my work this is my job it's YouTube now granted I don't earn like a significant amount of income like other full-time youtubers have like you know the youtubers who have been doing this for five plus years who earn like a nice chunk of change doing YouTube videos that they can afford to pay pay like their rent and like you know their car payments and stuff like that like I am not earning a significant amount of money but I am doing YouTube as a form of income and in this meantime in this window that I have as a break I really want to pursue YouTube full-time but I think I'm just so discouraged right now and just so unmotivated because of how inconsistent I've been. You guys know if you've been with me that Hubs just recently came back from his 7th month deployment to Afghanistan. So it's just also us adjusting to each other's schedules and adjusting to the norm again. I just love spending time with him, you know, off camera. Not to say that I don't want you guys to see because of course I do. Like I say all the time, I genuinely consider you all my friends and like honestly, like a part of my family and I really we both really genuinely support you all for all of the love and prayers that you have just been sending our way ever since he was deployed and it truly truly means the universe to us um, but you know there are some moments where when we're just hanging out on the couch and we're literally not doing anything we're just enjoying each other's company during those times I don't feel the need to like whip out my camera and just film us sitting on the couch you know what I mean like we're such homebodies where we really don't go out all the time like we do if we need to but we really don't go out all the time we just like spending time at home and just being with each other there are definitely video ideas that we have in mind of videos that we want to do but with just because of how busy we've been this month and just this summer in general it's just been a little bit hard to you know incorporate how am I trying to say this it's like it's very difficult to incorporate an official like YouTube schedule and my previous schedule that I was doing before hubs came back was Monday Wednesday Friday and then that kind of fell off for a little bit because I got caught up with like finals and stuff so I'm thinking once July is over is when everything is going to start to settle down and we can really get back into the swing of things I can get back into filming my YouTube videos regularly I know a lot of you have just been missing content 
content from me, especially the Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Works content, and I miss filming them for you guys too. And another thing with that specifically that's contributing to my lack of motivation with making YouTube videos is that, you know, I have to prioritize like what I'm spending my money on now because I'm gonna have to start paying back my student loans very soon. I'm also going to have to start saving up for the wedding. So I'm not saying don't expect as much haul videos, but that's why I'm saying, you know, there's going to be more lifestyle related content on my channel because, you know, I have to start saving my money. So with that being said, it's not that I won't be buying anything anymore from Bath & Body Works or Victoria's Secret, but at least when it comes to body care, you know, I just got so overwhelmed with hauling each and every single collection. I have a lot of different scents that I don't even use. Like I haven't even opened the like seal, the protective seal with the Victoria's Secret lotions. They're not even open because I haven't even opened them. So it's just like I need to, you know, really prioritize and really be selective on what I'm choosing to spend my money on just because I have more important things that I have to save up for. And I also have to start like being selective of what I spend my money on so that's why there hasn't really been that many haul videos as there were before but rather it's not going to go away completely but you're just going to be seeing more like I said lifestyle content more vlogs because I love vlogging and hubs loves vlogging too so just more of those types of content as well so I hope I didn't chat for too long like I said guys I feel like it's just been a while since I sat down and updated you all on what's been going on recently so I hope this covered not every Everything because there's still more I want to talk about but I hope this covered like the main points so I'm gonna end the vlog here thank you all so much for taking the time to watch this video as always I love you guys so 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 much I hope you are all doing well take care and I will see you all in my next video peace